The title of this project is Best Materials for Homemade Rockets. Now, you might be wondering, what's the point in a rocket? Why would someone need to make it homemade if you can just buy one? The point of this entire project is not specifically to benefit any uh, person or society in any specific way, other than just to have something that they can do for fun and in their free time. My hypothesis for this project was that I believed that the plastic rocket would fly the highest and farthest. The reason that I did this, that I thought this, was because if the lightest of the rocket, if it was the lightest of the rockets, it could have had the strongest liftoff, which um, could have gotten it the farthest, because the higher you go, the farther you can go. And as a rocket and the best start, the potentially best finish you can have. So as you can see, there's not too many variables, but there are very important ones like what the wind is because that can completely affect the distance and in air time. What the uh, weight of the rockets are, what if it's raining, even if the sky is cloudy, you can barely see the rockets in the sky to measure them of how high they go. How I decided which rocket could be the best was I had uh, six different rockets. I had a store-bought rocket, which is from a kit that was um, from any SD's store or place that sells SD's rockets. Um, a second one like that, but with um, a rounder, rounded nose. Um, then the, and the original kit gave you a pointed nose, a wooden and bamboo rocket, which um, this one was the pointed nose and this one was the rounded nose, and a pointed plastic rocket, and a pointed, uh, and a rounded plastic rocket, which were from a 3D printer. So how you could measure different ways to see which one was better is we had three categories um, of what we were measuring. We were measuring the height, how high it went in meters, we were measuring the rocket's distance, how high, it went, how far it went in meters, and the rocket's in air time, which is how long was it in the air before it touched the ground. In my review of literature, I learned lots of different things and so many cool facts um, ranging from anything to how the engines work and what was in them powering the rockets and how the aerodynamics of the rockets worked. In the materials and procedure of this project, it's pretty long. It's four pages long with them together. Um, but if you were just making one rocket, I'm sure it would be much faster and easier. Um, in my results, I found the uh that the store bought rocket was um definitely the best in all of the almost all of the categories they were the first uh first two um both types of them were the best in almost all categories then the second two were wood and the last two were the plastic ones the wood and the plastic ones actually had the wood being the overall better than the plastic ones because prob because there are many factors that can change the difference between the uh, flight and distance and air in air time because if you have a heavier rocket you might not be able to go as far 
and you might not be able to have as much in-air time. However, in my analysis and conclusion, I talk about how the weights of all of the rockets, except for the store-bots, were pretty similar. The store-bots um, were 27 and 30. The wooden rockets were four, uh, 57 and 56. And the plastic rockets were 55 and 53. Even though the plastic rockets were lighter, they weren't the lightest in my hypothesis. So that part was already proven wrong. However, even though they were lighter than the, uh, rock, the wooden rockets, they still didn't do as good overall in, the, in all of the categories. Um, here is one of the bamboo rockets that successfully had their parachute deployed. Here is uh, the final test of one of the store-bought rockets that actually nose-dived into the ground and broke apart. And here is a picture of the last launch of a wooden rocket that actually nosedived too, but split the bamboo in half. So, overall, as I've stated, the store-bought rockets are the best. However, in height, um, in air time and distance. However, if you're looking for a cool way to have fun building and launching your own thing that you know you made, then the wooden rocket, which is simple to get with a bamboo tube um, from any piece of bamboo, is obviously the second best if you, is obviously the best if you don't wanna buy a rocket.